the ministers play around with figures, it's not a 2.2 billion increase. It's probably more like 1.4 billion over the, the course of the next five years. Uh, and while it will result in an increase in social housing, it will be nowhere near enough uh, to tackle the level of crisis that's out there. Uh, I'm also very concerned that at the very end of the press conference, Pascal Donoghue uh, confirmed that in fact the increase in capital spending for social housing next year is a paltry 150 million. And again, given the depth of the crisis and the growing level of family homelessness, that doesn't suggest that the government uh, really is taking this crisis as serious as it needs to. If I was to ask you to give uh, Simon Coveney and the government a mark out of 10 on this? I'd give him 5 out of 10, uh, having said that I gave Alan Kelly a 1 out of 10. There are improvements uh, and there are individual policy measures uh, throughout the plan that I would certainly welcome, although even those uh, are timid uh, in themselves. There are also areas where they clearly haven't done enough. For example, uh, they've kicked the reform of the private rental sector uh, into the touch of autumn. Uh, so uh, overall, the core social housing target and funding is not enough. There are some positive steps, particularly in the homeless area uh, and uh, in legislation to protect, for example, the families in Tyrrellstown. Uh, but again, they're timid and there's areas where there simply isn't enough action.